Before we jump into it, I just want to say thanks to everyone that's subscribed and because most of my loyal subscribers follow my Husqvarna content, I thought I'd do a little giveaway. This is a first for this channel. So this here is a GoPro 7, which is my second camera. It eats the dirt. It um, gets some of the B-roll. And I even have that number two on there for all the dirty work. So anyone watching this video can be a lucky winner of this camera. All you have to do is keep watching. At a certain point in this video, I'm going to have a code come up. To secure the camera, go on Instagram, search for Afrobiker. So you don't need to give me a sad story. You don't need to say anything else but the specific term or word that's going to be shown in the video so it's going to flash in the middle of the screen uh, just pay attention and then from the pool of all the people that are going to go on my instagram and send me a dm of the phrase or the term that's going to flash on the screen i'll randomly select one person it won't have anything to do with how many comments you've left previously just head over to instagram dm secure yourself this gopro hero 7 black even though it's visibly not literally black all right let's get on with the video What's up, folks? It's your boy. For those of you that are always tuning in for the 701 content, my most recent related video was showing that I put on the Pirelli Scorpion Rally STR tires. And I kind of had a feel for them on, on road. But people were like, man, we don't want to see none of that show us how it performs off-road so i was able to have a sneaky early finish at work and i'm going to see if i can find an off-road area where we can put the tires to to the test and the area i'm heading to is in the southern region of perth i've been there a few times last time being last weekend when i took my yz 252 stroke bike we'll see how the 701 fares not in comparison to the yz or the yz also in comparison to what it was like before with the Michelin Pilot Street tires that I had because comparing it to the YZ250 with the Nobbies is just gonna be totally unfair also before I forget when I was changing the tires I also got a new chain and opted to change my sprockets so before I had a plus 2 at the back which was a 44 tooth sprocket and a 14 at the front but I thought just for the fun of it because I had a full length brand new chain that I could resize to fit whatever sprocket I was going to choose I was like let me go one more tooth up in the back so I went up to a 45 so I've got a 45 tooth sprocket oh look at this evil nice brother nice yes yeah, so I've got a 45 tooth sprocket at the back and 14 at the front for anyone wondering i'm still able to maintain highway speeds 100 k's in sixth gear and it feels comfortable but any bigger than that i think you definitely have a significant difference doing highway speeds cb out
Yeah. Not too shabby. It's a bit of an unfair test, really, because if you're coming to a place this deep in sand, just look at the back top. If it's this deep, then you're riding the wrong bike with the wrong setup. Like, nobody's barely making it through this stuff. But for the sake of size, we're gonna do it. This is sand is so deep that you don't even need a side stand. Look! I seem to be doing fine. <laughs> Alright, little guy. This is 100% better off-road than the setup that I had before. I'm just giving my honest opinion. I've ridden about 500 kilometers on the road with these tires and not, not that long off-road. As you can see, I'm currently on this mammoth soft sand road, which is the ultimate test for any kind of tires. Like, look, my shoes just, once you just step on any sand, your shoe just gets buried in there and it's tractoring along just fine. Okay, Ooh. that was a test not just for the tires but for me as well. Okay, so this kind of terrain here, I think is what the tires are more suited for. Soft sand, I mean, they did it but not ideal. The front has been much looser than the back as I see that the front just keeps diving but the street tire is gonna dive a lot more than this but anyway and now I'm gonna head back home to my wife and my daughter back onto a bit more predictable surface as stated at the beginning of the video guys secure yourself a GoPro Hero 7 Black by sending me a DM of the secret code that flashes at some point of this video on the screen. As always, thanks for watching. It's your boy Afrobiker signing out.